Today we are going to talk about how to sync files and folders with Microsoft OneDrive. This is a very useful feature if you want to keep your documents safe, organized and accessible anywhere, whether your computer or directly online. Many people know OneDrive exists, but they don't really take advantage of everything it can do. So the truth is, once you understand how synchronization works, your life becomes much more easier. So no more worrying about copying files manually, okay, manually from one <laughs> device to another actually. So let's get over over the methods to sync your files and folders with your OneDrive. So the method number one guys is install and set up OneDrive on your computer or laptop. So the first thing you have to do is to make sure OneDrive is installed on your new Windows. So usually it comes pre-installed, okay, but if not, choose to load it for free from Microsoft or official website. Once installed, open the app and sign in with your Microsoft account. Let's see if the my computer right here, right, right here, is already pre-installed the Microsoft. So how I can, how can I see that? I'm going down below, and I'm going to see that cloud right here, and we are going to click in. But let's suppose it's the first time that I'm seeing this right here. So let's see how can I um, how can I get out of my account. Unlink this PC, unlink account. Okay, so this will be the page that it's fresh and raw for you guys that never used the OneDrive. You're going to click right here and we're going to click and sign in. When you click sign in, you're going to put your account, your email address, and it will be logged in. For me, it's already, it will already log in automatically because I already did it. But as you can see, I'm reorganizing everything. I'm set up in everything again. So right here, you can choose where your OneDrive folder will be. So I can choose another location, but I won't. Just click next. And here's saying that my folder already exists because I already had, of course. I'm going to use this folder. Here you ask what do I want to sync and back up on my computer. For me personally, I don't like to set up everything automatically. I, I want to choose what I want. Okay, so I'm going to take that off. Okay, I'm going to click next. Not now. And next and next and next. You just click until this page come up. Your OneDrive is ready for you. So open my OneDrive folder. Okay, guys. The method number two and the continuation of this 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 whole video is to move your files and folders into the OneDrive folder. So after set up, the simplest way to sync is to move your files into the OneDrive folder. Ah, where is the OneDrive folder? So I'm going to this PC and as you can see it created right here Lu1 personal. So everything that will be inside of it is of the OneDrive and everything that I put right here will be on the OneDrive cloud. So let's suppose I want to um, take this photo right here and put it on the cloud. I can click with the right button of course and go on show more options if you are using the windows 10 it will be already on this thing right here on this part right here and right here you go on move to onedrive so when you move to onedrive the page the folder will automatically open and as you can see the status right here as is as as it is a photo it will be very quickly to send but as <laughs> as can be a, a, a folder or a file that is bigger will be a, a, a symbol on, on the status right here will be a symbol on the status right here that is like um loading so when it's finished as you can see will be this symbol right here okay you can also make that part right here you can go on the file and just press hold and just drop above it and you'll be right here as well 
as you can see the symbol is loading now and it's finished okay the continuation of this method is access your files through the web if you are a computer that isn't used or a laptop on a house that isn't used but you want to access your files you don't need to install anything just open a browser okay open a browser go to OneDrive website okay and sign in with your Microsoft account there you can see all your synced files you can click here on my files and you have access to all your files that you had in your computer okay one of the OneDrive biggest advantage is file sharing so you can right click any file or folder that you want and select share when you select this thing right here OneDrive generates a link that you can send to others and you can decide if they only view the file or also edit so this is a perfect for teamwork since multiple people can collaborate on the same document without emailing different versions back and forth okay so to recap to sync your files and folders with the Microsoft OneDrive you can install and set up the app move files into the OneDrive folder, choose which PC folders to backup, access your di data to the web, so use the select sync and share files with the others with the option that you want and with this your files are safe, organized and available anywhere. If you want, if you still find it difficult to configure, feel free to contact me using the link in the description. I can help you to set everything up quickly and securely. Okay? So if this video helped you guys and don't forget to leave a like, subscribe to the channel and turn on the notification so you don't miss the next tips. And comment below if you already use OneDrive or if you have any questions about syncing your files. I will help you to have you and uh, help you out and I'll see you in the next video bye bye